One of the things that Shutterstock is really excited about is uh, joining the Alliance for Open USD. We're at a point where uh, USD is, is being adopted across the industry. USD is very, very convenient for sending to different softwares. Just in the last year, the momentum around Open USD has been really exciting. There's, there's now new industries that are now needing to utilize 3D content um, that weren't using 3D content before. This increase in virtual production in terms of AI production techniques is massively increasing the, the demand for USD digital twins of our clients' products, regardless of category. Um, automotive, CPG, um, beauty, healthcare. The, the models that are um, in existence in libraries like Shutterstock is incredibly valuable in supplying the, the content for those new pipelines. These are industries that um, they're, they're not filled with 3D artists. They're filled with engineers and scientists and other people that need to utilize 3D, but don't know all the ins and outs of, of 3D. And OpenUSD is, is going to help enable them to be able to do more interesting, more amazing things uh, with 3D content. Interoperability is always an issue. Uh, and so we saw USD as a way of, of being able to um, improve that and actually solve that problem for us finally. USD is really useful file format to transfer in between different 3D softwares. You can finish the whole workflow. And it's not just the interoperability, it's also the power of it. It's the things that you can do with it, the things that you can store within it. With generative metadata is extraordinarily important. It's important that things have more meaning than just a mesh and a material. For simulation, they have to have real physical characteristics. For machine learning, they need to have detail around the materials, detail around the parts of the object, details around variation. And all of those things are all things that you can now fit within a USD and then move them across multiple pipelines. And so we see a lot of power in that. Um, we're really excited about it and we're looking forward to um, announcing it for SIGGRAPH.